ये है आम जिंदगी ओके गूगल फ्लश माई टॉयलेट ये है मेंटो जिंदगी Let's see how to make it. Open Play Store, search for Bling and install it. Create a new account using Gmail ID as I've already created it. I will go for login. Click on new project, give project name Toilet Flush, select hardware as Node MCU. Click on Create. An authentication token will be sent to your Link Gmail ID. Open Widget box, select button, and place it in the right position. Click on it and select Output Pen as Virtual V1. Go back and click on Play button. This finishes the setup of Link app. Now open your Gmail. Click on the mail which has been sent from the Link app. Copy the authentication token. Open browser from your mobile. Search for ifcbt.com and open. It. Create an account using the Gmail ID. Click on Continue with Google. Now choose the same Gmail ID which has been linked with the Blink app. Click on profile, select create, click on this. Search for Google Assistant and select it. Choose trigger as say a simple phrase. Now type the command which you want your Google Assistant to follow. Type the command which you want in response from the Google Assistant. Click on Create Trigger. Click on that. Search for Web Hooks and select it. Click on Make a Web Request. Type the Blink app URL as shown on the display. Give a forward slash paste the authentication token which you have copied from Gmail slash update. Slash V1. Select method as port. Select content type as application. Slash JSON. Type one in double quotes within square brackets, which indicates the digital input signal to turn on the servo. Click on Create Action. Then finish. Your Google Assistant is ready to respond for the saved comments. Let's move to the programming part. Open Microsoft Store, search for Arduino IDE and install it.
Open the Arduino app. Now copy the code whose link is given in the description and paste it. You need to make few changes in your program. Type the authentication token, your Wi-Fi name and Wi-Fi password. Save the program. Select the board as Node MCU 1.0 and COM port according to your PC from Tools. Upload the program to Node MCU. The code has been successfully uploaded. Okay Google, flush my toilet.